That's Cat Hargett. Here's a rope dolly. Stuff for everything I can get in it. Lights, light bar, water monitor, pump, rudder throttle. So we're gonna do a little test and everything, see how everything works out, okay? So, let's sit down here and play with a few things. There's my trusty Tyrannus. Let's see the menu of everything set if I want it. So rudder. You got rudder. Uh, let's play with the lap bar. Or the, not the lap bar, with, with the... There's that. So the pump. I've also got set up using a small speed control, an old uh, Pixie 20 from Casper Creation, so I can adjust the flow. All right, uh, let's look at our lights here. There's the nav lights, and there's the spotlight. And last thing, we'll be the emergency light bar. I think eventually I'll get a siren for this thing too. There we go. Go through the different functions. And off. And there you have it. <coughs> Roby Dolly, which are a Marin Dolly. <sighs> Stuff full of, full of equipment. Um, it's gonna be fun. I just gotta route everything around now where I can get to, I can get the deck in without everything rubbing. Right now, I just got the receivers kind of stuffed in there. Everything's going everywhere here. I'll show you. It's a mess. Now, my power wiring is all in good shape. But now I've got to route all the wiring and the receiver and everything for the, uh, for the radio. I just wanted to get everything hooked up. So, all right. I just wanted to give it a test and see how it's going to work. And there you go. Thanks for watching. Uh, some of the guys were wanting to see how this thing on uh, on uh, rcboating.com want to see how this thing works. So here you go. This is the fire monitor that's built for the Roby Dolly. Now, right now the inside's a mess. I'm just testing everything out. I start to route things around. Um, so the way this thing works, there is a monofilament line. It comes from back here, goes down here, and there's a tiny tube that is inside that main tube along with the hose. Now, if you'll look real close, you can see the line coming out. That line goes down a tube that's about one millimeter inside diameter, if that. I don't think it's that big around. So basically, the spring pulls this thing back up. And the spring got caught when I was messing around with it, so it's a little sprung, but still works. I could use a little bit more, but. Uh, and basically when you tighten up on the line, it pulls it down. So I've got it where it's just off, just off. Um, horizontal, hor right about there is where it likes to be at. But you can get some altitude with it too. So you can sit there and have a little fun with this. The pump I'm using, I'm using on another channel so I can go and I pump water in my boat, that's real good. But <clears throat> the pump is the pump that was came with the kit. I've got it on a rotary, both of those on, on the top rotary switches on my Tyrannus. So I can literally uh, control the flow of water too. So um, got lights. While we're here, got lights. So, and we got a light bar. So we've almost got us a fire boat. I, just, I gotta get everything kinda worked out. And your thing moves around. That's right now it's a mess inside there. It looks like a squirrel went nuts. There you go. There she is.
uh, fire boats. Once I get all that finished up, I can start working on some details and things and just make a pretty boat out of it. Thanks for looking. That's not going to be a stroke. <laughs> yeah, she's all lit up. She's all lit up. Well, good enough. <laughs>